In this video, I'll teach you how to create this with your smartphone. In this video, I am going to teach you how you can create amazing product advertisement video in CapCut. I will show you the step-by-step -step way to create a product advertisement video using CapCut. So let's jump right into the video. Alright guys, so the link to download CapCut is in the description below. So once you download CapCut, just tap on this new project. So the first thing to do is to input the particular background we want to use. Just click on the link in the description to download the particular background. Alright, so I'll go to my photo. Then I'll tap on the background and I'll click on this add. So once I add the background, the next thing for me to do is to delete CapCut watermark. So I'll tap on this watermark and click on delete. So once I do that, I want to extend my background. So I can just extend this background to uh, maybe 5 seconds or 4 seconds. That's okay by me. Okay. 4 seconds is okay. So once I do that, the next thing for me to do is to add my text. So I'll click on text. Then I'll click on this add text. So the first text I want to write is 24 hours. So I'll type it. So once I type it, I'll go to fonts and I'll change the font to handwriting. So once I add the 24 hours text, the next thing for me to do is to write my second text. All right. So I'll tap on this text, then I'll duplicate it. Then I'll click on this edit. So right now I want to write flash sales, but the first thing I'll write is flash. Okay. So once I do that, I'll change the font to this particular font that is here Balor. then i will just increase the size of the text so once i do that i'll place it right here all right then i'll go to this style to change the color of the text so i want the color of the text to be black so i'll tap on it then i'll click on this mark so the next thing for me to do is to write my third text so I'll duplicate this particular text, I'll tap on it and duplicate it. So here is it, I'll just edit this text. So right now, I want to write sales. So I'll just write sale. Alright, then I'll change the color to white. Then I'll just position the text to be here. Alright guys, so this is so perfect right now. So once you add all of the text to your background, the next thing for you to do is to add animation to the text. So this 24 hours, I'll tap on it. Then I'll click on this animation here where the arrow is showing. So I'll tap on animation. So the animation I want to use is is in right. Alright, so this is the animation here is in right. Then I will increase the duration to be 1.0 seconds. Then I'll tap on this mark. So the second text also, I'll tap on it. Then I'll go to animation. So I'll also use the same animation for the second text. So the animation is is in right. All right. I'll tap on it. Then I will increase the duration to be 1.0 seconds. Then the third text also, I'll tap on it. And I'll go to animation. Then I'll also use the same animation and increase it to be 1.0 seconds then i'll click on mark all right guys so this is so perfect right now all right so the next thing for me to do is just to extend this particular text to the end of the background all right this also i'll extend to the end of the background to the end of the background all right so this is so perfect right now and the next thing for us to do is to add our product image so for you to add a product image, just go to overlay, then I'll click on this add overlay. So I'll just go to my eraser. So this is the first product image I want to add. I'll tap on it, then I'll click on this add. So once I add it, I can just decrease the size. Okay. 
all right guys so this is okay by me so i can just extend this particular product image to the end of the video also all right so after adding this i want to add a button so i'll tap on overlay then add overlay so i have already designed the button i'll just go to my pixel app to add it just click on the link in the description of this video to download all of these things i'm using all right so i'll tap on this pixel app then i will input the particular button i designed on pixel app so i'll click on hard once i had the particular button that's the order now then i will decrease the size and i will also place it right here so the next thing for me to add is the 50 percent off so i'll tap on this add overlay so right now i have already designed the 50 percent off so i'll just tap on it then i'll click on hard all right guys so here is it so i'll just decrease the size and i will also place it right here all right guys so once i do this i can just extend the particular duration of it to the end of the video all right so everything will be at four seconds then this particular one also i will extend to the end of the video so i want everything to be at exactly four seconds all right so once i do that the next thing for me to do is to add animation to the particular overlay i added so here's the first overlay i added the product image so i'll tap on it then i'll go to my animation so i'll click on in animation so the animation i want to add is row right all right just find for row right here is it row right so i will increase the duration of the admission to 2.5 seconds so once you do that just click on this mark then this second one also i'll tap on it that's the button i added which is the order now button so i'll go to animation so here's the animation so i'll tap on in animation so the in animation i'll be added to this is also row right all right so here is it row right then i will also increase the duration to be 2.5 seconds then i'll click on this mark all right so the last one is the 50 percent off that's get 50 percent off so i'll tap on it then i'll click on this animation then i'll tap on in animation so the in animation i'll be adding to this particular one is spine left this is it spine left then i will also increase the duration to be 2.5 seconds once i do this let's see this video and let's see how it looks all right guys so this is so perfect right now so the next thing for you to do is to save this particular video so i'll just tap on this 720p so i'll increase it to 180p so i can get high quality video then i'll tap on this where the arrow is showing to save my video so i'll tap on it all right guys so once you save the video just go back and right now you might want to add more product image to your video so the thing you need to do is just to tap on the particular product image you added so i'll tap on it then i also replace it with another product image so i'll just go to my replace here is it where the arrow is showing so i'll tap on replace so right here i'll replace it with another product image all right so i'll go to my eraser so i'll tap on the second product image i want to add i'll tap on it all right so once you tap on it it will automatically replace it with the first product image so the only thing you need to do is just to adjust it so i'll just decrease the size then i'll place it right here so once you do that the next thing for you to do is to save this particular video also before we add the third product image so i've saved this video i'll tap on this save to save this video all right guys so once you save the video i'll go back then i want to add the third product image all right so you can add as many product image as you want 
So right now, I want to replace this particular product image also. So I'll tap on this replace. So I want to replace it with the third product image. All right. So let me see it right here. So here's the third product image. I'll just tap on it. Like I said, the only thing you need to do is just to adjust this. So I'll just adjust this. Then I'll place it right here. So you can actually add as many product image as you want. It depends on you. So this particular one also, I will save it. I'll tap on this to save the video. So once you save each video with each product image you want to use, then the next thing for you to do is to actually join all of the video together. So I'll go back. Alright, so for you to join all of the video you have saved, just tap on this new project. So right now, I'll just tap on the video I saved. So here's it. Here's the first one. And this is the second video. And here's the last video. So I'll click on this add. Alright guys, so here are the video I save. So this is the first one, the second one, and the third one. Alright, and the next thing for you to do is to add a transition to your video. So here is a place you can add a transition where the arrow is showing. So I'll just tap on it. So right here, there are many transitions you can simply use for your video. You can just tap on anyone and use it for your video. So once you do that, the next thing for you to do is just to add some cool music to your video. So you can just tap on this audio, then you click on this sound. There are many songs you can simply use on CapCut. Just tap on any one you want and simply use it for your video, alright? So once you do that, the next thing for you to do is to save your video, as you can see. So here's our video. So before we save our video, let's play it and let's see how it looks. Alright guys, so this is so perfect right now, so for you to save your video, just tap on this place where the arrow is showing, so I'll tap on it. So the video is now saving and this is the end of this video tutorial, I will see you in my next video tutorial.